guys, today I'm going to be doing another back to school related video. I first of all want to say that I definitely would have liked to have this up a little bit earlier. I know probably most of you guys are back in school already, but I think this video totally still applies like it's either the beginning of the school year or you're about to go back so I would have liked to have this video up a little bit earlier but you guys just I can't even make excuses anymore I've been busy but I did want to get up like another back to school video for you guys and I'm really excited about this one I'm going to be doing a school supplies haul and giving you guys some organization tips of just like tips and tricks that I've learned throughout being in middle school and high school like finishing all that and just like the things that work best for me and just tips on how to stay organized and have like the least amount of stuff possible but like still enough stuff you'll see what I'm talking about and the exciting part is I'm going to be giving away everything that I'm talking about in this video because I don't need any of this stuff so I went out and got some stuff that I would have liked to have or that I would have picked out for myself if I was going into like senior year or something like that if I was gonna go back to school myself this is the stuff I would have gotten and I'm going to be giving it all the way to one of you guys so listen at the end of the video for that information that will be like the last thing I talk about but uh, yeah I'm just gonna go ahead and get into it so first thing is a backpack so this is one that I picked out and it's from Victoria's Secret Pink and it is awesome in my opinion it's galaxy themed it's super bright and cool and I thought most of you guys would probably like this I don't know I think the galaxy trend is awesome and I, I really like this like I, I want this bag for myself I use a backpack this year so I would probably have selected a backpack for this year just like a tote bag just a nice school bag to kind of hold everything so this one has two side pockets which I don't have anything in them because I'm giving this away but I would I don't know what I would keep in there maybe like gum or some essentials or something and then it also has a front pocket right here let's go ahead and go into the bag and this is the school supplies that I would have gotten for myself if I was going back as I said to like high school or something like that this is pretty much yeah stuff that I would pick out for myself okay so first thing we have here is these are like my favorite invention in the entire world these what are they called expanding files this one is six pocket I think this one's really really cute it's like all floral print and this was my best friend in high school oh my gosh like I used to carry around probably in middle school or something those big binders and you just like don't even need that pretty much you can use this and I use this for all of my classes because it was perfect for me because this was six pocket and I before senior year I had six classes in high school and then I had like a lunch period and a like seminar period. I had six classes so this was literally perfect for me because it has like six different sections and I would just keep like in order like first period, second period, whatever. You can like put little names for your classes on the tabs and just keep literally just like all your stuff in here and like when it gets you can clear it out when it gets really heavy and you know when you just have all this stuff that you don't even need anymore. So yeah I found these were just so helpful and it was so much easier than carrying around like a big binder and also this was awesome for me because I would just like only take this home. I would put like my notes and like my homework in it and I wouldn't have to take home like multiple binders. This was so essential for me and if you're the type of person that you don't want to carry a bunch of books this is gonna be great for you. I also have this notebook and this is a five subject notebook and this again was my other best friend like these basically were the only things that I carried around senior year because I didn't have any textbooks senior year. These five star and I mean they have them in other brands too but these like multi-subject notebooks are so awesome like I still have one of these I'm using one of these right now for my college classes because I love them they like divide it so you have a certain amount of paper for every class and you can keep it separated because they have these like folders so I would keep like notes in here and things like that like and then I would just like take notes for the class in here or like you can rip it out like if you're turning something in I don't know these are just so easy and I like having it all together like I mean you can definitely get like multiple subject notebooks but this is totally what I would get because I didn't have to go back to my locker to switch them out I was all about like the least amount of stuff possible in high school and like the easiest stuff and these kind of match together so I think that 
those are cute together. Next, I got some highlighters, and these are just little pocket highlighters, and they are five different colors. I am not gonna lie to you guys, I pretty much, like, I would buy highlighters, but I wouldn't really use them. I would use them to, like, color or, like, doodle in class, but I feel like they are nice if you're the type of person that when you're, like, looking through notes, you want to have certain stuff, like, stick out to you, or you're, like, highlighting your notes. It's just nice to start off at least the year, like, with some highlighters. I don't know about you guys, but I would like start off the year being like, yeah, I'm gonna be like an A plus student this year and like be so good. And, like, I don't know. I would always like start off the year really good and then it would just it would go downhill. They're mini, everything's better mini. Okay, this is kind of boring, but like just basic black pens because I feel like everyone needs these for like your English class or something. Ooh, okay, the fun colored pens. Yes, I picked these out for you guys because I loved taking notes. Oh, and are these erasable? Oh no, they're not erasable. I thought they had erasers. I was like, that's that's kind of weird because I feel like erasable pens don't write as good as regular pens. So I'm like glad that these aren't erasable. I loved taking notes and stuff that I wasn't going to turn in in like fun colors because it just makes it a little bit more like bright and fun. And when you're like studying, I don't know, I think it's funner to study purple and pink and blue notes than just all black notes. I don't know. It's kind of silly, but some of you guys can probably agree with me that it's just fun when you're not turning in stuff to write in different colors or to write in your agenda in fun colors. So I got you some fun colored pens. I also got you some post-its and I decided to get these ones because these are the little tab ones that are just like tiny and that you can like bookmark a page in a book you're reading or in your textbook, something like that. Uh, and they're all a fun, bright color. Next, I have some magnets and I thought these were really, really cute. They're like some bright colors and they're magnet clips and there's four of them and I thought these would be fun for your locker. I would have liked to get locker shelves. If I had seen locker shelves at Target, I would have bought some for this video, but yeah, uh, these are really cute. You can hang up like pictures or just like whatever you want to like clip, you know, something important, something cute. You can hang up little things in your locker. So I thought it was always fun to decorate my locker, except for senior year, I didn't go to my locker once. I was I was so lazy senior year. I, I didn't go to the my locker once the entire year. Another tip I have for you guys that I just thought about because of locker shelves is if you have the type of lockers that I had at my high school where it was like a locker at the top and a locker at the bottom like not full length but not like really tiny lockers just like I feel like it's a normal size locker the one I'm talking about I would get two locker shelves that would enable me to like hang one from the top if you have two hooks at the top of your locker I would hang one and then I would put one on like the bottom of the locker like you're supposed to put a locker shelf and that would make it so I had three different sections in my locker and it looked super organized and what I would do is I would put like my textbooks in one section I would put my um, like my notebooks or like binders if you have individual binders for classes because I used to do that in one section and then at the top I would put like my school bag after I got to school and like unpacked my stuff in my locker or like my lunch or something like that I would put both of those at the tops and I always got compliments in high school on how organized my locker looked and it really wasn't that organized I guess it just looked like it because I had three shelves and no one else really had like a locker shelf but I found they were so essential because I didn't want all my stuff just thrown in a locker like I wanted it to be like sectioned out so I could just like easily access my stuff so I would definitely recommend investing in two locker shelves if you like having your locker kind of organized I would always get the pink ones from like Staples or Office Max or something But as I said, they didn't have them at Target or I would have gotten some for you guys But yeah, that's like a little tip I have for you if you want to keep if you're like organized like me And you want to keep stuff like divided next. I have some colored pencils I didn't really need or use colored pencils. I don't think in high school I don't think they were on like my supply list, but I'm pretty sure they were in middle school so I got 24 and I got this pack because they have some like fun colors like pinks and stuff. They have like different colors than the, the normal ones with just 12 pencils obviously. These ones are the Bic or BIC. I don't know. Bic. Mm, BIC. <laughs> I don't know. I think it's Bic. Mechanical pencils in kind of like fun colors. These are the ones that I use. This is eight of them in here and I feel like that's like pretty good to start off the year with. I always lost pencils. Like I lost pencils like every day but nice to start off with a bunch and buy more if you if you need to I think this is the last thing in here yeah uh, it's kind of boring but it's just some filler paper 150 sheets because I feel like you will just need this at some point like put it in like a folder if you're gonna be like writing essays and stuff I don't know just I always needed filler paper so yeah that's everything 
yeah that's everything in here I hope it was enough stuff as I said like I didn't want to go crazy I just kind of wanted to get some stuff that would fit in the backpack and what I feel like is necessary without going overboard for yeah that's the stuff I'm going to be giving away including the backpack obviously as I said one person is going to win all of this stuff and here are the rules it's pretty simple to enter basically the rules are you just have to be subscribed to this channel and my vlog channel so I will have my vlog channel linked in the down bar if you're not subscribed so you have to be subscribed to both channels and then all you have to do is leave one comment It's gonna be one comment per person because we don't want spamming and this video to get taken down for YouTube So one comment per person on this video tell me what grade you're going into I would love to know and tell me like something about this school year maybe something that you're excited about or something that you're dreading or try to keep it positive though I like to read happy comments so maybe tell me one thing that you're excited about this school year or something that you're doing soon that you're happy about I don't know just tell me something that I would like to read pretty much and tell me what grade you're going into because I am interested so this giveaway is going to last for two weeks I'm not sure of the exact day that I'm posting this video so two weeks from the time I'm posting this video I will put the date right here and it's going to end it's going to go all the way through that day up until midnight Pacific time because that's the time that I'm on so it's going like you can enter all through that day but then at midnight 12 a.m. of the next day it's gonna be over I will not make a whole video for the winner but I will announce it on Twitter and like I'll tweet it probably sometime that next day and I will announce the winner also on this video that you're watching right now I will list it in the description box like the first line of the description box I'll be like the winner of this giveaway is blah 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 with their username so yeah that's how I'm gonna announce the winners so not on like Instagram, not in a separate video, so just remember to like check back on Twitter or check back on this video um, two weeks from this day if you want to check and I will message the winner personally on YouTube and get their information. Just make sure you're, if you're under 18 that your parents know that you're entering or would be cool with you entering. If you win, I would have to get your address, so just make sure that they're cool with that if you're not 18. And I hope you guys like this video. Thumbs up if you like the school supplies I picked out, if you're excited to get the chance to win, or if you liked this video. And I think that's all I have to say. I really, oh, and it is an intern. All my giveaways are usually always international. So it is an international giveaway. Anyone in the whole world can enter. I think that's it. Just one comment per person. I think that's everything. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video and found some of my like tips and tricks helpful and just, you know, enjoyed seeing the school supplies haul. So thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you very soon in my next video. Bye.